Hello and welcome to a, another video on the Enrico IRC380. Today we're going to run through how to assign a PTT button to Zello and to stop the RF module taking control when you press the PTT and uh, using Zello. So well, first of all we'll just show you as again we are using Visor uh, just here. We're connected via the PC um, and we're going to just run through the first initial steps at the moment of uh, assigning a button to the PTT for Zello. Now, when the radio first comes, if you fire up the DMR side of the radio, the RF module, the PTT will actually be in full control of the radio. Um, and if you assign a PTT to Zello, uh, what happens is you'll see in a moment the PTT takes control with the DMR side and not on the Zello. So let's fire up Zello. We're here in the Echo Talk channel and we're just going to assign a PTT initially to get going. So you scroll down to options, go down to push to talk buttons and just down the bottom right hand here we see a plus button. Press the plus button, it asks you to press the button so you can assign any of the buttons at the top but PTT or the big PTT or any of the other buttons. But if we're going to click the original orange PTT button here to assign the main push to talk button. So I'm going to press that once. There we go. We have got it assigned. It says now there hardware button. So once we go into here, what you must do is untick this handle button in the background when possible. So if we untick that or close it off, what will happen now is even if you shut the app down completely for Zello, uh, the PT Zello will not start up. So Zello will just not fire up. If you have that button enabled, as soon as you press the push to talk, Zello activates and it will start using Zello straight away. So you need to make sure that this button here, this tab is turned off so it does not use it in the background. If you want to use it while the screen's off, you're going to have to do this. But bear in mind that, that this will override uh, the every other app in the Android. So if you're using Echo Link or any other, Zello will come to the front. So you need to make sure this is off. So what I tend to do is make sure that I only use one app at a time, this is turned off, and then just use it that way. You can listen and uh, have all of them running, as long as you don't want to press the PTT, otherwise um, the app's going to pull to the front. Anyway, we've got that now sorted. So if we go back to options and I press the into the Echo, oh, we just lost connection, just gone back up. If I now key up on the echo link, you'll see that it actually fires up. Let go of the button and there we go. We are connected using PTT. So now the button is mapped. If I now come leave Zello up and running, I'll show you what happens. So now we fire up the DMR app. This is now running the DMR app. So there we go. Now, if I was to press the button, I can't do this at the moment because it will shut the computer down because uh, RF around by here. But if I was to press the button now, Zello will not work and this radio will activate on the RF module now. So the PTT will not um, work Zello at all. You, you'll hear it, but you cannot access Zello at all. If I go into Zello now and if I press it quickly, you'll see what happens. There you go, we're disconnected and uh, I'm just going to connect again. There we go. But it didn't. You can see it's um, it was receiving on the DMR side. So what you need to do if you want to use Zello is go back home, go back to DMR, come down to your settings and you need to close this app. So click close and click confirm. And as long as you see the home screen like that, from now on, everything else will work on that PTT that you've assigned. I'm pressing it now and it's not bringing the app up. For, there you go, press it again, and that's it. So what you've got to remember is if you want to use Zello or any of the other DV switch, Link Poon, Echo Link, Peanut, when you want to use these apps, you need to make sure that you close the DMR app down. As long as you close the DMR app down, you can use all the other apps on the main PTT that you assign and it will work absolutely fine. If I go to, um, my DV switch just here and if I go to my config scroll down you can see I've assigned this is the PTT for the main button 290 I've assigned that there now um, and if I wanted to use it it would key up but obviously I've got Zello working so Zello will probably key up at the same time so you need to make sure you shut Zello down if you want to use something like D, um, DV switch 
So we'll just come back out of that. Just click out, exit out of that, go back to Zello. And if I press the PTT button, Zello's still working. Now, if you want to use any other apps, make sure you sign out of Zello and then exit. And now if I go into DV switch and use my PTT button, it works first time. Absolutely no problems whatsoever. And again, if I want to come out, just come out of the app, uh, back out of that. There we go. And if I want to use another app like, I say Linkpoon. Linkpoon's a pretty good app. This will log in now. Once it's logged in. Oh, it's timed out. What a surprise. I don't know why that's doing that. Let's uh, try activating account again. Activate now. There we go. Log back in now. So now someone's talking on there. So I need to go to the uh, A channel. I'm going to go out to dual watch mode. Now, if I press the PTT button, it is now working. Absolutely fine. No problems whatsoever. So there you go. That is how you uh, activate your PTT button and how you make sure that it does not come to the forefront of everything. Just remember, DMR app has to be closed down to use any other PTT app within the Android system. So as long as this is closed down, these work. And to use this, just make sure all the other apps are closed down as well, because you don't want to be keying up this DMR and then it coming through Zello at the same time because it could happen. So just make sure everything's shut down. You're only using one at a time. You can listen to all of them. You can have them all fired up and listening all at the same time. Just make sure you don't PTT. Uh, one other thing um, to remember is that when you're using the DMR on the the RF side on the IRC380, it is the top right hand microphone that you are using. So when you look at the radio, the microphone just at the top along the right hand side of the camera, that is the microphone for the RF side. Once you're using the apps, it's the microphone down the bottom between the zero and the star button. So that's the microphone for the apps and your microphone for the RF is the top right hand side. So just remember that because people say your audio is quiet, you're probably not using the right one for the RF. And if they're saying you, you're quiet on your apps, you're probably not using the right one. So top for DMR and the RF and the bottom one is for Zello and all other apps. Hope that was useful. Remember to like and subscribe and make sure you put a thumbs up because it always helps the channel. Thank you very much and uh, goodbye. We'll see you again soon.